So we made it a spear pillar. Are you guys gonna double battle me? Maybe, maybe. And Guzma coming out of nowhere with the 100 bits with the thumbs up thing from above. I appreciate the 100 bits, Guzma. That's kind of you. I'm gonna switch here in case it's a double battle is what I'll do. Darkrai will happily hold on to that. Thumbs up, dude, who's now just gonna perpetually be in the jar, I guess. Hi. Our boss is about to do something spectacular. Spread the good name of Fortnite across the universe. Oh, it's so evil. It's great. Don't get in our way. Of course you will, won't you? That's why the two of us will team up to take you down in an epic duel. I was gonna make like a reference to some other tag team, but then I didn't even know what I was gonna free. You're telling my team Galactic Grunt, Team Galactic Grunt, set out Chrome Gunk and Stunky. Oh no! My goodness. Well, time for uh, the first double battle that we've done in a good while now. But yeah, we gotta stop Team Galactic from remaking the universe to one in which Fortnite is supreme. <laughs> we must stop. Their evil scheme. I apologize to anybody watching this who, <laughs> who plays Fortnite, but like, I cannot help but constantly make jokes like that. I used to play that game um, back before there was a PvP, back when it was just PvE. I had a lot of fun with it back then. I was, I don't say this a lot. I was actually one of the people that played Fortnite day one. I, <laughs> I got a freaking copy from my, from my cousin because he got like some ultimate edition thing that comes with like four other copies of the game. So he wound up giving one of those to me. So I wound up playing with my cousin and his friends literally the day that Fortnite came out. It was only like half a year or something like that ish later that the PVP came out. And by then my cousin and myself and his friends weren't playing the game as much anymore because we got far enough that it got to be kind of grindy and, and I don't know. Um, I tried the PVP like once and I was like, yeah, I, nah, <laughs> not for me. No, thank you. I'm a, I'm a pass on that, methinks. Um, I guess I'll just do this and stuff like that, but Kraken, you're doing well. You now have set up a bootleg channel point system on your channel? You have a Fortnite story? <laughs> What's this Fortnite story gonna be? Are you doing it through, like, Streamlabs or something like that? Because Streamlabs has a point system that I used to have way back when, before before Twitch had channel points and such. Back when, freaking, I used Streamlabs channel points, Nice, a critical hit. Nice, nice. People used to be able to do game requests from me with the old channel point system. And the last time that happened was Bravely Default, which wound up taking me like half a year on and off to get through that game was the thing. So uh, that uh, I haven't had the option for people to request games from me until this Mad Lad May thing of like a handful of select Mad Lads being able to just request stuff. But I haven't done like open requests since then, back when people used to be able to request full playthroughs that could take anywhere up to like half a year, depending on the game, just with channel points. We're not capable of slowing you, let you pass, you can get pulverized by our bosses so they can get their victory royale. Hi. Where do you think you're going? I won't let you disturb our boss. He's busy meditating while standing up while eating a bowl of insert sponsor serial name here. Uh, if you're not going to listen, you'll have to go through me first. After all, you've made me look bad more times than I care to remember. And I'll be next. It might be tough, but this time the gloves are coming off. Oh, and Lowe's. Hold on one second. Don't you start the party without me. I gotta do my freaking sorta of chilled Michael voice, huh? Remember me? I'm here to get my revenge. It's so weird having, you know, not Barry as like, super active and stuff. Huh, if it isn't that little boy, the little crybaby from Lake Acuity. Did you stuffing up a bit? I want to say strengthen, but then I- Sure, let's battle two on two. Welp. But yeah, Guzma, you're gonna be our being against Rise Fiance by making a cake before she gets over her first day of work at her new job at Baskin Robbins. I don't know what Baskin Robbins is. Is that a states thing? Is that a thing in the states? I don't know if we have those in Canada. But I wish you luck with that cake, Guzma. You're gonna- gonna share here? Nah, um... But yeah, <laughs> Kraken, so you play on BZ with a friend a long time ago, but your game would not load buildings, so you cannot open chests or see anything. So you win, wins, gunless, went gunless for most of the game. Friend died insanely early on, so you just played a pacifist run nearly the whole game and got second place. Nice. Sometimes it'd be like that. When did Michael get a freaking munchlax? When did this happen? This should be like normal effectiveness. Uh, wait, unless I want to... I don't think bronzors have levitate, do they? Gosh darn it, I've googled this before. I need to google it again. Is a thing. Serbi Bronzor. Let's find out real quick. And let's go to the Generation 4 decks. No, you have Levitate. You definitely have Levitate. 
is the thing. It was like Magnemite that didn't have Levitate or something. Um, we'll just like surf through everything and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, um, they got Baskin Robbins in Japan as well as in the States, you believe? Like, I think I might have heard of the name before. Gosh darn it, is... No, no, why? Why would you do this? Uh, but yeah, pretty famous ice cream shop. I think I've heard the name before. I had no idea what they even sold, I'm sorry to say. Well, we got our Flareon Vaporeon here, who's literally under your level. Everybody's getting surfed. <laughs> Surf's up, nerds! If I let my hair down, I could go into, like, the full surfer dude mode with this hair. If I just let it down at my shoulders, we could go freaking full surfer dude and surf's up. Oh, man, this is gonna suck, isn't it? This is, um, this is gonna suck here. But yeah, uh, also next week you're gonna start you're starting your own playthrough of Skyward, so I'm not gonna wait for the Switch release or whatnot. I can't believe you're extra soon in me! How dare you! And you're just gonna stockpile and stuff. Okay, not gonna be very helpful in this battle, I guess. Welp, let's go ahead and boopy bop. <laughs> Surf's up, bruh! Radical! Radical. Well, we just need two more surfs. Easy peasy. At this rate, we'll have the serfdom complete by next year. My oh my, if you with Joy-Con, not worth rebuying the game. Yeah, probably not. But I'm a freaking showcase it for my channel anyway, is the thing. Like, there's a lot of things that I wound up purchasing for the sake of this channel that I never would have freaking done if I was never a content creator. But that's the way things are with me. There's a lot of things that I just do in general that I wouldn't do if, you know, I wasn't a content creator. I would be playing Pokemon Platinum here right now if I wasn't a content creator, for example. Like, I couldn't really see myself coming back to play randomly, like, right now out of nowhere, you know? But, channel things, you know? So here I am, doing this. Well, bunch lax fainted. Couldn't, couldn't have just led with Infernape. Oh, you're not gonna like this. I apologize. <laughs> couldn't have just led with that. Just play whatever you want. I mean, that is what I do here a lot of the time. But, you know, I'm amassing my freaking page of all my playthroughs I've done, trying to fill it up with, you know, however many games, going through the games on my shelf until I can look at it and be like, yes, all the classic titles that I wanted to cover are now covered. The day, the day's never gonna come, is it? It's probably never gonna wind up coming. It's one of those goals that you can just like never hit. I feel like, but still, but still, it does feel, does feel good to do that. But yeah, money is absolutely a precious resource. It absolutely can be. Like, I am definitely glad that the channel is at you know a place where, you know, I'm not making anywhere near what I would be if I was working the same amount of hours in, like, a part-time job at minimum wage or anything like that. But, the Twitch and YouTube channel are at a point where, like, if I want to pick up, like, whatever game, or... Oh, it looks like that did it. I mean, my surf would have done it as well. If I want to pick up, like, whatever game or, like, X equipment for the channel, it's like, hey, I can label that as a freaking stream expense in my head and then use the freaking you know, stream funds and whatnot. So it is really cool to be able to, you know, have the channel in a state where, you know, that's something that is essentially, you know, covered in A-OK -okay and yada yada. Like, for example, hopefully soonish, soonish, depending on when the back order is coming, I should hopefully be picking up a new graphics card for my computer, one of the freaking fancy schmancy 3070 thing bobs, which I've been on a back order list for since the beginning of October. Which, I talked to them at Memory Express, and they said that they're starting to get them in, bit by bit. Like, they're going to start with, like, their October back orders, like, very soon. So, hopefully that comes in soon-ish. And then that would, like, really increase the freaking stream quality, especially for games that I'm playing on the same computer that I'm streaming them from. Like, for example, like, any PC games that I play that aren't, like, this. This doesn't count. <laughs> this does not count. But, uh, you know, games that really push the graphics of my computer. I'd be able to stream those way better. And also just have like a better stream in freaking general because those things have like to, <laughs> whoa, whoa, that freaking jaw, you're like, ah, the pain. Like I'd be able to freaking, I don't have a, uh... what? Oh, you healed me with that. Um, There are graphics cards like that that do have like, oh, come on, dedicated thingmerbob. 
that they use when it comes to streaming is streaming. My graphics card doesn't have anything like that. My current one, unfortunately. I forget exactly what the freaking thing Rebob is called, but the, there's a thing. There's a thingy. We're, yeah, we're just gonna be spamming surf bit by bit here. Chipping away. How do we get to this subject anyway? <laughs> How do I start talking about graphics cards while we're in the middle of our Pokemon Platinum finale? How did this happen? I swear, this is what happens when I stream. No, why would you? I was about to take that out with Surf anyway. I was about to eliminate it with the power of the Surfdom. But alas, stop targeting me. I'm gonna call mom. Don't think I won't. Welp. Guess we'll do that. I could always use like a full restore or something, but I mean. Man. Man. I should probably switch out or use a full restore. Hmm. I'll just switch out, I guess, for now. Tactical refrigerator? No, I'm gonna send in Malice, is what I'm gonna do. Then I can use Earthquake and such. I assume that Michael's Float Soul is probably gonna wind up taking out that Ghoul Bat and such. Cool, cool. Ah! Oh! Of course! Why would it wind up any other way? <laughs> Why would it be any other way? Is the real question here. Poison jab? Well, thank goodness it's not me. At least it wasn't me. <laughs> That's my motto in life. No, it's not. Uh, yeah, be hyped there, Heracross. You're about to be hit with an earthquake. So I hope that Heracross takes out the cold bat, but we'll see. We shall see. Wait, have I thought of doing a Mario Party series now that there's online multiplayer? Wasn't there already online multiplayer, though? Was the thing with, like, however many minigames? Is there actually, like, a thing for, like, the regular game now? Is that a thing? They added board support. Huh. That could be very spicy, too, with some friendos. Though, something else that I was thinking about doing is I've experimented with Dolphin multiplayer before. Like, I did an entire freaking three-player Pikmin 2 playthrough, for example, along with Chublim and Uneven Pictures. And that was, like, hella fun to do. That freaking Dolphin multiplayer Pikmin 2 shenanigans. And since that wound up working out pretty well, mostly, with netplay, ever since then, I've honestly thought about hopping into, like, some of the classic Mario Party games. Like, either Nintendo 64 or GameCube ones. The GameCube ones would be easier to set up since I know how to do netplay with that. I don't know how Project 64 works with that. But I would love to do, like, some playthroughs of classic Mario Party games with, like, friends online just emulating, like, the local multiplayer off of netplay. I think that would be a blast and a hella wacky time, especially because I haven't played the classic Mario Party games much at all, you know? Yeah, <laughs> my Pokemon are tough, right? I can get even tougher. But you know, that's it for us. We've hit the wall. Harm, I'll help you with this. Ah, yes. Thank you. Michael fully healed Harm's Pokemon. Harm, this is it. It's your show now. <laughs> He's out of here. I've got places to be. Everything is ready for the creation of a new map. A part, a new map in addition to whatever the name of Fortnite Island is. Now, all will end. It will be a victory royale, and everything will begin. With this, the red chain made from the crystals of the three lake Pokemon. And this, the red chain I replicated with technology means, techno with technological means. You have two red chains? With these red chains, I will pry open the portal to another dimension. A slightly shittier dimension. I command that you unleash your power for me. I summon the imposter from among us. With this power, power never meant to be tapped into. Dialga, the mythical Pokemon, and the master of time. And the other. <laughs> and that other guy. <laughs> Dialga, the master of time. D and the other guy. I summon both of you. <laughs> Palkia, the mythical Pokemon. And the master of space and dimensions. I really wish he just ended it on and the other. <laughs> that would have been so freaking amusing to me. A black speck. Look at it. Open the way to another dimension. <laughs> Why does it look like a set of two big insect eyes to me? <laughs> For whatever reason. 
Hi, welcome to Chili's. Um, no, close the portal. I've waited so long for this moment, Tialka and the other guy. Shaping this world is a double spiral of time and space. Yes, the very things that you have the ability to control. I mean, space and time are kind of interconnected as one thing with space-time. Like, this, the universe in a way is kind of made up of sheets of space-time. So, I mean, you will do my bidding, I will have your abilities as mine. With the power I wield, I will create an entirely new world. So logically, wouldn't you be able to control space and time together? If you controlled either one complete- The incomplete and ugly world we have now can disappear. I am resetting everything to zero. Nothing can remain, except for me. And then Victory Royale will appear on the screen. And thinking about Victory Royale, I'm going into my semi garen voice from Fire Emblem Fates, who we've also joked about. I'm just now realizing, in my- We've been playing Pokemon Platinum and Fire Emblem Fates on this channel at the same time. And in both, we've had the exact same recurring joke of the freaking bad guys wanting to pursue Fortnite. I'm just now realizing as I went into my almost garen voice for Cyrus there. Well. It is all for making the ultimate world, a world of complete perfection. Nothing so vague and incomplete as spirit can remain. But one of my Pokemon's names is Spirit. Just jam out. I do like the lake theme and the stuff that it does here. Oh, we got actual 3D models on the bottom of the screen there. Yeah, Gen 4, and I guess 5 Poke 1, were for the most part stuck in 2D, but there are some instances of using 3D models. I should have expected as much. Uxie, the being of knowledge. Azelf, the being of willpower. And Mesprit, the being of emotion. And also just now, in the chat, <laughs> Mortis has redeemed a name of Poke 1 for 5,000 channel points. You will name the box legendary Lucifer. What- what's the box legendary? Wait, I guess- I guess you mean just the next one that we catch- I thought you were gonna say you will name Palkia the other guy. <laughs> Pokemon have come to protect Sinnoh. Pathetic and worthless. It takes the three of them. The three lake Pokemon. The three houses of Fire Emblem. I still have my freaking Byleth amiibo just chilling here. I'm just gonna put him on my desk over there. The three lake Pokemon that symbolize spirit to balance either the Pokemon of time or space. But they can't maintain balance against the two of Dialga and the other guy. Not when both Dialga and the other guy are here. Their coming here is in vain. So much meaningless drama. Now, Harm, you've constantly interfered with my plans, but you will be forgiven. After all, there will remain no spirit for all time when I am done. All spirit will disappear and will be ripped away. From you, from your Pokemon, from those precious to you. It is time. My dream will be a reality. My victory royale is in my grasp. There's this pressure I feel. Something is enraged. Oh god, no, it's the ShamWow guy. Oh no, it's Belle Delphine trying to sell Gamer Girl bathwater! Our worst nightmare is interesting! So, there is a Pokémon that can only appear as a shadow. Regardless, the effort is rash and foolish. I have harnessed the powers of Dialga and the other guy. I, Cyrus, won't have any more! <laughs> Jump scare moment. <laughs> that is not how that's supposed to show up. No, it's the Minecraft dimension, it's a square. <laughs> that is not how that's supposed to show up. <laughs> My goodness. Hi. Ten lows. It's free real estate. Birdie! No, uh... I'm sorry I took so long. I think I finally found the answer from studying the myths. If two trains are traveling at one another at 30 meters per second and 50 meters per second and they're 500 meters apart, I think I know how long it'll take before they collide. 
when this world was made, Dialga and the other guy appeared. <laughs> Apparently, there was one more Pokemon that appeared at the same time. A Pokemon with as much power as Dialga and the other guy. But also one whose name was never to be spoken. Bell Delph- uh, Giratina. It is said to lurk in another world, a world on the opposite side of ours. That's what the shadow was. It must have been Giratina. The pillars are distorting. Because of that portal, it's joined us to the other world. The Fortnite world that Cyrus wanted. If it's not closed, the distortion will spread to Sinnoh and beyond. Everything will become weird. The battlefield got weird. Our world will be destroyed. Are you ready? We have to chase Cyrus. Okay, we have to hurry. That is not how that's supposed to show up at all. 